Alrighty guys, I'm with uh, we'll Rise Up Lights, dude. Well, here we go. There's the rest of them. <laughs> but uh, yeah, man, starting out, uh, what made you guys uh, start out the band, if you don't want me asking? Are you guys the you know original members and yeah. all that? Okay, well, made, what made you guys so, start it out? We, uh, him and I started losing cadence together. Yeah. What year? 2011? 2010? Something like that? Yeah. What, 2023 now? Um, that was losing cadence for a while and that just became Rise Up Lights. Just name change. Well, it came. Yeah. Yeah. Um, Cape Miracle Drive. Oh, God. Uh, we moved up to Pennsylvania yeah. for a couple years together. Okay. And lived in an attic with no heat. Good <laughs> God. Yeah. Uh, we lived in an attic with no heat and people who didn't speak a lick of English. Some distant family of his. And we ended up uh, sharing a hair dryer. Sharing a hair dryer and a heating pad to keep warm. Because yeah. it was freezing in Pennsylvania in the winter. Uh, and then I decided to move back home. And then he came down uh, a few months later and Rise of Lights came back. Oh, and here yeah, we are. Man. Well, uh, what was it like uh, playing oh, in front of us? Oh, yeah, that's true. Yeah, that was a, that was Those guys. Brave New World. You should yeah. No, oh, they're sick, dude. Pete. They're yo, sick, man. Pete, but, uh, yeah, no, but uh, what was it like playing in front of a sold-out crowd, dude? I mean, you guys you guys have played a Red Jumpsuit before, you know, but I don't think it was sold out, right, before? Yeah, so this is the first sold-out show with them, so. No, it's very because of the first time being in Destiny. Yeah. Funny yeah. story about playing with Red Jumpsuit. We, uh, we played with them in vinyl the second time we opened yeah. in Pensacola. And they, uh, Ronnie got sick, and they had to cancel that day, so it became a local showcase yeah. for us and Brave New World and Scream Out Loud. Yeah. And we learned face down that day to cover it, and it's still a crowd's never gone crazier than when we covered face down when yeah. we couldn't make it. So, thanks guys, appreciate it. Nah, that's super <laughs> sick though. But uh, yeah, um, so I mean, did you guys grow up together? Like, I mean, go to high school together, anything like that? No. no? We met at a show. Yeah. Yeah. What, what I, show was that? I you remember? <laughs> I, I know where it was. It was at a, a venue that doesn't exist anymore. It was called uh, the Vault. The Vault. Okay. And he accompanied in guest vocals on the song before I even really knew. Him. Yeah. He had like a sombrero or some shit on. Yeah, I wore a sombrero and I jumped up and did guest vocals without telling him I was gonna do guest vocals. Yeah. Because I, I thought they were cool. No, playing. that is really cool. And then he took me to the the back room and he's like. <laughs> That's like kind of creepy. I want, I want to manage it all. And then it just became... Bro, that's how relationships start, though. You know what I mean? I mean, you got to, like, that's take it. that chance. I and... I be a yeah, exactly, man. Band -man. Yeah. Did you see the use? I see you're wearing a use hood. Did you see I, him in the, yes, the uh, base? Yes. Yeah, that was sick, dude. The day to remember and all that. Yeah, man. But, uh, yeah, dude, uh, you guys got a lot of good uh, music coming out, man. You guys want to, like, you know, shout out any songs or anything like that? You think you're going to be uh, y'all's favorites coming out? or? Well, uh... From, I don't know when this is. Talking to Mike. <laughs> uh, I don't know when uh, the video right now is dropping. But Probably like a week. On, yeah, on February 3rd, so a week from today. Yeah. Um, oh, cool. Yeah, sick. Uh, our, uh, our song for is dropping. Yeah. So, yeah. We you guys excited. put it in there, right? Yeah, yeah. yeah, yeah that was sick. Third, yeah, um, yeah. Got some videos of it that we yeah. might like, make a little compilation. Yeah, yeah, man. Yeah. That was super yeah. sick. Yeah. Working on. The car was just so cool. like. Yeah, yeah, man. And we've, we've already finished the second EP, so. Uh, That's awesome, that dude. We've got like a whole album, 16 songs. Like, yeah. Ready to, like, ready to roll. Yeah, I've been a fan of y'all since like 2019. Uh, I think the Red Jumpsuit show was like my first show I actually saw you guys with. Oh, and, uh, yeah, 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 yeah. But, uh. Before the whole pandemic. Yeah, exactly. It shut everybody down, bro. It was pretty depressing. But yeah, man, um. I'm a big fan of your guys. Uh, you know, I, uh, I come to all y'all shows whenever I can. You know, sometimes I go to work, but I would say about 75% of the time I try to make y'all shows. And you let us know. We'll call your boss next time. Yeah, okay. We'll get you, we'll get you all marked. Hey, I love how you guys play, like, all the venues, man. Downtown Music Hall, the Handlebar, you know, uh, Club LA now, like, all these cool venues. Yeah, yeah, man. We want to play all the venues, like, everywhere else. Too. Yeah. Do you guys have a favorite one? I know you know what I really like to say that, but. Uh, I do. Okay. Uh, Hannibal all day. Hannibal, yeah, man. Uh, that's where we. Oh yeah, from the south. Yeah, from the south. Yeah. But, but like, if they brought back like their place that if they like brought it back, I'd probably freak out. Like, yeah. Miss the old like, Fuggos, like, like Fuggos. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. I, like, if I could get back in that room just to like walk around for like a second, just like sniff. Yeah. Or whatever. The red door. Yeah. Yes. Watch it. We've... And that's where I uh, saw a day to remember and got into the yeah. music in the first place. Back in the red door. And they shouted that out when I saw them in every. Really? Yeah, yeah, that was well, because Shanti was there. Shout out Shanti. Um, no, that was 07. They showed up in a van and a trailer, and now they're headlining the Civic Center. Yeah, dude. Wild. It's wild. crazy, man. It's crazy. 
Well, uh, what's some upcoming shows for you guys, man? Next week we're playing Downtown Music Hall. Yep. Yeah. Emo night, right? Yeah, 26. Yeah, it was like emo karaoke night or something like that, right? Yeah. yeah. Hop out. Yeah, man. Yeah, hop out is cool too. And then uh, we have a show with Until I Wake, who's on. That's gonna be a sick show. Yeah, yeah, yeah. That's gonna be a sick show. Yeah. yeah. Um, Dude, I mean, you guys have played with them enough times, you know what they I mean? Like, like, yeah, yeah. they. So I talked to their guitar player earlier, and I was like, man, it's been a pleasure opening for you guys, like, fourth time now. Like, we appreciate you having us. And he was like, dude, we love your name. We always say your name. And I was like, mm. Yeah, yes, dude. I mean, I feel like great. I feel like if they're always letting you open for them, you know what I mean? They're, 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 there's definitely some kind of like love there, you know? They definitely like y'all's music. Yeah, well, and, and when they need an opener, we'll There's similarities there too, you know what I mean? So it definitely makes sense. But yeah, uh, I, I was dreaming that out in middle school. Yeah, I mean, dude. Nobody in high school and getting in front of by the middle kids. Yeah, right. Exactly, dude. Exactly. Yeah. Now, like, you know, you see those same kids and they're listening to it. You yep. know what I mean? Those same kids that beat us up. Yeah, <laughs> it's wild now, dude. It's weird how the world is. But yeah, man, I just wanted to, uh, you know, interview you guys. You guys are one of my favorite local bands. Uh, I, like I said, I love when you guys play. I always try to make the shows. And um, I'm going to be at the, uh, the uh, Until I Wake show. I'm, I'm going to try to make the emo karaoke night, but I'm not sure if, I can, if I'm going to make it since it's so close. You might need to, bro. Call your boss, bro. <laughs> you might need to. <laughs> Show him this video. Yo, he needs to be at every one of our shows. Yeah, man, Yo, I'm down with it. <laughs> but yeah, man, I really appreciate you guys, dude. Uh, you guys are awesome. You guys have an awesome set. I'll include some clips into that as well. And uh, yeah, bro, anything you guys want to shout out or say? You know, name off the video. Buysaplacefl.com. Oh. And buy some merch, man. Yeah, buy. dude, they got some cool stickers. I got a couple. Dude, we're trying to sell out this merch, and then we're gonna buy real merchandise. Yeah, yeah man. And hell yeah. Flavored like our albums. And if you guys want to check out like the Pensacola music scene right now, is the best it's been in years. You've Hundred percent. Vagrants on. Vagrants is awesome. Brave New World, hop out. Vagrants is playing next month too at the Handlebar. Yeah. yeah. Hard Nose Scars cool. is doing fantastic. Yep, right now. they're really good. Name. Yeah, man. Um, love James and Brian. Yeah. After Dusk is in Mobile. Yeah. Yep. Um, love the Hate is in Mobile. Yeah. yeah. Just this area in general. Right now. Come down and see us. Yeah, yeah, yeah. See all this. It's a good time. yeah. Follow you guys. Uh, follow them on social media. You guys are on everything, right? Yeah. TikTok. We're yeah. Really yeah. TikTok. That's big now, dude. You got to yeah, get into TikTok, dude. Trying, yeah, to, I mean, trying to pump up TikTok. The younger generation, dude. That's how they. That's how you find out bands. You know, nowadays it used to be like MySpace and stuff like that. Now yeah, it's you can TikTok. Do up in like ten different like little clips. Yeah. Put on TikTok. Yeah. We're like. Yeah. I'm just a boomer and can't figure out the TikTok dances. So that's why we haven't gone viral. I'm right there with you, dude. I can't. I can't understand it at all. But, but no, yeah, riseofplacefl.com because that'll take you everywhere with all the links and all that stuff. And then we're I like put a little picture of us up there, and then like there's little songs and <laughs> little vid songs. videos. <laughs> and I, I like put uh, I don't know. Uh, like but, but that's it. Check out the, the Pensacola music scene right now. Yeah, the man. Gulf Coast is blowing up and uh, riseuplightsfl.com. One more question, guys. One more Last answer, question. You gotta go first. What? What would you say? One more answer, but you got to go first. Okay. Uh, what is y'all's one of y'all's favorite bands locally that you think doesn't get a ton of credit that you think uh, you know deserves to be shouted out and people to listen to? Brave and, New World. Uh, Brave New World. Brave New World all day, every day. I can't say anything else. Like, we're in the world, yeah. Frog, what was it? Frogs in a Well was in my top. I like Azuna. Uh, Uza, Azuna, we're I don't, gonna I don't even know. that. That song? No, I told, Wait a better song than that. I, tr I dare anybody. I told Christopher Eubanks, I was like, whenever whenever that song came out, I was like, this is gonna be in my top. He's got a dope Spotify, voice, too. Yeah, yeah, yeah. And sure enough, when Spotify rap came on, that was like number three on my top played songs. Yeah. So, well, definitely check them out and then Vagrants. Yeah. Brand New World and Vagrants. Yeah, yeah, man. But Vagrants does get recognition. They're like fine. They, oh, yeah, you said. Yeah. 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 Well, I mean, they still don't, but. Still, you know yeah. what I mean? I mean, they're. And their, their guitar player just joined uh, the word a lot. That was pretty cool. Yeah, I mean, Brave New World is yeah. 10 times bigger than they were like three months ago. So, by that logic, by some people, they'll be like already in the credit. So, Brave New World's probably already famous. Like, yeah. Famous. <laughs> so. But yeah, that's Brave New World and. Um, Excuse me. Yeah, very cool. Yeah, yeah, man, that's it. <laughs> well, I appreciate you guys a ton, man. You guys were awesome once again tonight. And uh, yeah, I appreciate you guys talking with me, man. Yeah, and uh, good luck with racing, dude. I said, oh, heard yeah. you said you're going to take the year off, but he also does racing at Five do. Flags and um, other places. I might be out there places. a couple times. The car's, yeah. the car's getting ready. I'm just. Talking you're in a, what, Pure Stock Sportsman? Pure Stock. Pure Stock, that's what I thought. Um, yeah, man. Yeah, Pure Stock, and we are 
Um, I'm a fan of that. That's why I shouted. <laughs> yeah. Come on, we'll, we'll put you in the pits for this. Yeah, man. I, I want to make a point here. You beat emo like NASCAR. Yes. You beat emo like NASCAR. That's right. <laughs> you beat emo like NASCAR. Can we make a shirt? <laughs> It you should, should. be hey. emo like racing. There we go. That should be that's the TikTok. Well, there we go. You well. can be emo like NASCAR. <laughs> and if I'm at a NASCAR race with black fingernail polish, dude, singing some date to remember songs. You're gonna get your ass. Beat. It's a new wave, dude. <laughs> <laughs> it might happen. Yeah. Well, hey, dude. I love you guys, man. You guys are awesome. Once again, you. for like the fourth time, I appreciate it. And uh, yeah, follow them on social media, Spotify, all that good stuff, man. Uh, take it easy. Thanks, brother. That's it. Yeah.